In our paper titled Filter Bubble or Homogenization, Disentangling the Long-Term Effects of Recommendations on User Consumption Patterns, we used agent-based simulation to examine the effects of recommendation algorithms. In particular, we focus on two phenomena, homogenization and filter bubbles. Homogenization is when users consume similar items despite the differences in their preferences. On the other hand, filter bubble indicates a decreasing overlap between the consumption of users with disparate preferences. Past research suggests that there is a simple trade-off between homogenization and the filter bubble effect. So in this paper, we ask, can we explain the dynamics between these two phenomena beyond just a simple trade-off? Our contribution in this paper is several fold. Firstly, we introduce the concepts of inter-user diversity and intra-user diversity. Inter-user diversity measures how mean individual consumption varies across different users. On the other hand, intra-user diversity measures how diverse the consumption of a single individual user is in expectation. Note that if we have high inter-user diversity and low intra-user diversity, then each user is essentially consuming items in isolation and we have a strong filter bubble effect. On the other hand, if we have low inter-user diversity and low intra-user diversity, then everyone is essentially consuming the same mainstream items and we have strong homogenization. Based on these dynamics, we propose two novel definitions for filter bubble effect and homogeneity. Finally, we take a look at how past consumption-based recommendation algorithms affect user consumption. We know from previous research that these algorithms alleviate the filter bubble effect. The question is how? Turns out that they primarily affect inter-user diversity and do not have a significant impact on intra-user diversity. Given this, we ask ourselves, is it possible to design recommendation algorithms that will affect both types of diversity simultaneously? We propose two such recommendation algorithms. The first one, bean consumption-based recommendation, drives users towards items that are popular within their own genre. The second one, skewed top peak based recommendation, drives users towards niche items universally. As shown in this figure here, both of these recommendations affect inter-user diversity and intra-user diversity at the same time. We hope that our results will pave the path towards better recommendation design in the future. Thank you.